Hello everyone, it's me Trey, and today we're gonna be playing Subnautica. Okay, so I know very little about this game. All I know is that we are crash landed on an alien water planet. Think that I'm gonna start on survival mode? I'm only like a minute in and I'm already confused. I have to say, the music is pretty good though. You have suffered minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal outcome. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive I on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. So the fabricator, I'm assuming, is like the crafting area, probably. Okay, so I can make nothing. Guess that I just... Damn, there is water as far as the eye can see. Well then, the Aurora I suffered orbital guess failure. I'm just Core going to go unknown. into the water now. Zero human life signs detected. underwater but what happened if a person actually tried to spray a fire extinguisher underwater huh I genuinely want to know this one. Thank you. 
Okay, so this thing makes med kits. That's actually pretty helpful. How do I use the med kit? Okay, I have no idea how any of this works. Like, at all. So I just use the med kit. And... So storage is where all the stuff that's not in my inventory, I can put it there so that it's safe. My inventory is the stuff that I need on hand, like a fire extinguisher. I think I'm beginning to get it. limestone in this. That's, that's actually pretty helpful. Alright, so I break the limestone and okay that was useless gonna swim a bit more I see wreckage now, is that from my ship or was that already there? If that was already there then how did that get that I just came out of. So, this is an escape pod that... Something happened, it's not fully functional right now, and I am trying to escape. I cannot escape without repairing all of this stuff. Okay. I still can't make it. The water is a makeable thing. And... Excuse me, how does bleach make water? Like, is there water in bleach? Or are you using... That makes sense. So you're using the bleach to disinfect the water. Oh my goodness, this game is really smart. Okay. I think what I'm going to try and make right now is the standard O2 kit. I just need to find some titanium. Alright. That's probably possible. Alright. I got all the titanium from metal scraps, breaking more rock deposit thingies. Regardless, I found it. And now I can stay underwater for a longer amount of time. Huh. I see the floating air pump. I think I'm gonna make that as well because it's gonna be a lot more helpful if I can just refill my oxygen while I'm underwater because it's it's kind of difficult to go up and then go back down because that means that I will always have a certain amount of oxygen that I do not have so I think I'm going to make a floating air pump and then also make some pipes to work with it so I guess I'm getting some more titanium that's gonna be fun. Detecting e detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet fall.
fluid in it. Vital signs stabilizing. going to be something here that's helpful. None of this wreckage is salvageable. Salvageable. Wow, that's a really annoying word to say. Grab trap. Hmm. That's cool. So basically all of that was useless. Hmm. Well then. back there one more time and then just go back to the base because I'm not sure I just want to try to understand a bit more about what's happening here because I do not understand how to escape at all so I don't know how to get all these stuff stuffs Cave. Yes. Okay, so I'm going to go and explore the cave because that is a good idea. Probably. There's also a creature egg. Hmm. That's weird. I. Wait a second. In that case, I'm going to break the limestone. Copper. Is an and I got copper. Alright, so with copper, I Your should be able to make some has just to batteries, I think it said. Now if I can make batteries, then I can make the scanner, and if I can make the scanner, I can learn more about stuff. So I think I'm gonna go back to the base now, learn about this alien egg, try and make a battery, and from there... I have no idea.
print acquired. Power cell. Hmm. Okay, so that's another thing I'm gonna want to make. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to accord alien biological data. So now I can learn a lot more about places and things so that I, you know, don't die because that's the goal of the game. Anyways, I think that I'm going to try and learn about the writhing weeds because I might be able to eat them like, you know, seaweed or something. No? Maybe, maybe. Hopefully I will be able to eat the writhing weeds. Sadly enough, I cannot eat the writhing weeds or the table coral. Huh. However, I may be able to use the table coral to make a computer chip. Well, I can't harvest it, so it's still pretty easy. Anyways, it's nighttime and I am extremely worried that there is some predatory creature near the craft site. Self-scan complete. Huh. Vital I can signs normal. Scan Continuing myself. To monitor. That's interesting. I want to learn about these things. Yeah. Yeah, I totally want to learn about these. Because they have this weird poison gas that, like, hurts me, I guess, as I get closer to it. So I have to learn what it is and see if I can use this poison gas as a way to defend myself if there is a predatory creature that is following. Anyways, gas pod. Slow moving life form and none of the larger herbivores on and one of the larger herbivores on the planet providing a substantial meal to would-be predators. So I'm assuming I may be able to eat it if I can kill it. But I don't have any way to kill it. Mm-hmm. Audible cells. So I can use the acidic pods to do something. Alright. Not doesn't tell me too much, but it tells me that they're big and they know where predators are. So if I see gas pods and I see them running away, I may know that there are predators nearby. I, I'm probably right about this. That's good. So I can eat the boomerang, however, they can fight back. So I might not want to eat them, or try to eat them, until I have a way to effectively kill them like, at range or something. I definitely want to see what that little stingray, like, ooh, what's that eyeball? I can pick it up. So I can probably eat that without, like, any extra. Okay, I have to find out a way to kill this. Because I'm beginning to get hungry, I guess. I wish that this guy had some ceram wrap so that the, our only Please source of water wasn't just Seek fluid intake. stuff that we already have. Because it might not be ceram wrap. There's that little trick where you take salt water and you do something with it. But I don't.
don't have any way of getting water, so eventually I'm just gonna, well, you know, after I take all the water inside of the storage chest, then I won't have any way of not dying of dehydration. Alright, that's not good at all. That says, food. So I do get more food, but I also get my less water. Everything on this planet just wants to kill me, doesn't it? This is going to be very difficult. use the water. I need to find a water source very quickly. Okay, so I lost some stuff. Huh. Let's see what I lost. I still have the metal salvage, so that's good. I still have the peeper. I still have the quartz. What did I lose? All right, so I don't think I lost anything. Actually, I might have lost a few titanium. I'm not sure though, but I might as well. I can make food now, cooked and cured food. So, good, I guess. Anyways, I think I'm going to get some more titanium from that metal salvage and start just exploring, I guess, and then hope that I find something new. going to store up this titanium. Wow, I got a lot of titanium from that. I'm going to store this titanium for later and then do something. That's important. Okay, so to make rubber, I need the creep vine seed cluster. All right. Hmm. Okay. I think I'm going to try and if I find the creep vine seed cluster, definitely make the rubber so that I can make a knife so that I can start hunting some more, harvesting some more materials because until I can do that, I'm kind of a sitting duck for predators. Hey, it's that cave from earlier. I'm probably equipped enough to explore it now. Ooh, there's a limestone outcrop. Mm -hmm. Another one. Hmm, this place looks pretty cool. probably a good place to end the video. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Bye.